here good morning how are you today i'm alone completely the whole day as you guys may know i usually have the masked man to help navigate me around and help me with things but not today i don't know where he's at he's leaving for the whole day it's left to me with no phone service by the way update on that i got the sim card t-mobile is my network and i keep calling them for them to unlock my phone so i can use it they haven't yet but they said within 48 hours but i have to go out today i want to get out and do things i rely hardcore on the map app. Lo and behold, in this area, Google Maps doesn't let you download offline maps. I don't know how to get around. I don't speak any Japanese. I'm used to it, like I rely on my phone like so heavily. It's insane. I'm one of those people that have like directional issues. But this is a day in the life. A lonely girl that doesn't speak a lick of Japanese. Anyways, let's start with what I am wearing today. I'm wearing this Adidas top that I cut because it was too tight. Yeah. I feel the need to be very quiet here. Use your outside voices. Everyone's super, super quiet here. So, and then I have this big scarf on that I brought. I have this jacket that I got at Ross for $15, brand new. It does have a hole in the armpit. That's okay. And then this I got at Forever 21. And then I'm wearing this underneath. And then I'm wearing this belt. Um, these sh shorts, leggings, and my pack. And then I'm wearing these white shoes that I got for five bucks at Ross. <laughs> they were on super, super clearance. I don't know. You just follow, follow me along. I have to stop at 7 Eleven to get money out first. Fuck, I don't even know where that's at. <laughs> the streets here are really confusing too because there's a bunch of little streets that go everywhere. Let's figure it out. Okay, so I made it to 7-Eleven and I got my money out. I made it, surprisingly. I got here. Now I need coffee because I'm tired. So let's go find some coffee somewhere. <laughs> My main point here is to get makeup and do like kind of like a Japanese style makeup, like how they do makeup here, or even like Korean style. I mean, it's kind of similar. So I don't know. I just need new foundation, number one. But I really like the way they do their makeup. So I'm gonna try to do like some Harajuku fashion slash makeup. So that's what I'm looking for. I'm really just wandering around. There's like so many people here. It's like constantly so busy. Every time I've been here, it's been so busy. But the fashion here is really, really cool. I am back. I made it back successfully. No worries at all. I think I learned the, the train system to Harajuku and back. Yes! <laughs> so, if you guys are afraid to do things, like, trust me, I have anxiety and I'm afraid to do everything. So you can do it. Oh, I can do it. I only, like, got on the wrong train once, but it was fine. I got some Korean-style makeup, which is the type of makeup they use here, too. And I wanted to do, like, kind of a replica of, like, Japanese-Korean makeup. I went out and got some groceries and I'll show you what I got because it's kind of interesting. Apples here are huge. Like you can't even tell, like, well, yes you can. Like it's, it's almost the size of, well, half of my head. My head's really big, okay, in comparison. <laughs> I have a really big head. So some of the stuff is like pickled, like that's a cucumber. 
That's like a radish. Actually, cream and something sweet, so I got this matchy. Um, and then the pumpkin here is so good. I got this egg sushi. I need to stop buying so many like packaged stuff. Don't help me about it. Anyways, all right, I'm gonna go to sleep. I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. It is, I don't know what day it is. Like I'm not keeping track, but it's the next day and I haven't put my makeup on yet. So I wanted to put it on, but I wanted to put my makeup on that I got yesterday to show you guys. Oh, it's actually really cold. So I'll show you the things that I got. The main reason that I went, because I wanted to get their lip tints type of stuff, because I feel like they don't really have this available much in America. The, like, a lot of Asian style, like, they wear, like, this lip tint that makes your lips, like, rosy or whatever. I feel like I need to exfoli exfoliate my lips. And I got this cute little blush. Whoops. Their, their skin is always so nice and clear and smooth. So I got this. It's Fix and Fix Primer. <laughs> And it's for the pores to make your skin just like more I don't know anything about this makeup like this is just I just like went to this one place and it's called Etude but it's more it's not even a Japanese brand it's a Korean brand but I feel like they use the same type of makeup and then I got a foundation because I actually need a new foundation so it's like a, a serum foundation I think but you could probably get this stuff in America I assume I don't actually know but it was just one of the stores there and there's so many Japanese people I was like the only guy should there and I was just like I hope that I'm allowed to use this makeup. <laughs> Sometimes it feels weird to be like, so like, odd, I guess. So, I don't know, I'm sure that I can use this makeup too. I also didn't notice what kind, I was noticing what people were buying, what people were looking at, because I wanted it to be kind of like a, a, an authentic look. So, with the eye stuff, I didn't want to spend too much money because I already spent too much just buying this. I'm gonna try to replicate the, the, the eye stuff that they use, because I think I have the same color of makeup. They use like a coppery type of eye shadow I found. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup kawaii style today. So I'm gonna begin. Okay, we're gonna start with the primer. Oh wow, it's like, oh, that's a very smooth, like, whoa, that's so weird. Fluffy smooth. It doesn't put on problem areas, but my whole face is a problem area with pores, so I'm just gonna put all over everything. The next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put on some foundation. I got tan. I'm not really tan, but I think compared to other, like to Japanese people, I am. So all the other colors were too light for me. Okay, so I got my foundation on. Next step, they don't really contour or anything like that, I don't think. Maybe they do but I'm not gonna go to that extent. I'm gonna put on a little bit of blush and I'm gonna exfoliate my lips to put on the lip stuff. I'm gonna do a little bit of the brows. Eyeshadow colors were kind of like shiny, but I'm gonna use like this copper one. I think that'll, I think that'll do well. Okay, so I put on uh, a little bit of brows and I also put on this white eyeliner like directly underneath my eyes just because I feel like that makes them pop out a little more, makes them look a little more like in my head that makes it look more like theirs. <laughs> and then I did a little sugar scrub on my lips. So this lip stuff should go on a little bit better. Oh wait, I'm gonna put on the, the blush now. On camera it doesn't look like I'm putting on much, but when I go look in the mirror, it's probably gonna be a lot, whatever. All right, so the final touch, and I think the most important, is the lip tint. And this is what people were buying the most. They were buying lip stuff. Not particularly like lip tints, but just like, they had a lot more lip stuff than they had anything else. You're supposed to have like a little brush to put this on, but I don't have one, so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply it with this. And then I'm just gonna like, and it smells like strawberry. No, just don't get any on your teeth. Also, it's gonna stain your finger. <laughs> uh, okay, so I did my best. This is my quite style. <laughs> Obviously, I'm not gonna like, it's not gonna look as, as good on me. I have no like qualities of like a Japanese person, but I hope you guys enjoyed that um, and enjoyed going to Harajuku with me. If you guys like this, give it a like. I am now going to go shoot some creative 360 stuff outside, which is freezing outside, but I'm gonna do it anyways with the mask man, so that should be fun. Stay tuned for the next vlog and I'll catch you, I'll catch you later. Okay, bye.